Hey friends and ministry partners, I'm so excited to be standing in the middle of a praise report uh, of what God has provided for New Sound Church as we continue to reach people here in Nashville. I'm standing here at Westwood Baptist Church uh, in Charlotte Park, the neighborhood that we've been reaching out to and engaging in as we've planted New Sound. And God has opened a door here at this church so that our church can begin to meet and fellowship and gather together in the name of Jesus. And we're just so thrilled to be able to show you what God has done. So come follow me. I'm going to show you an inside look at where we're meeting and the foundation of what New Sound Church will be. this door that God has opened, we literally have so much space to grow that our foundation that we're going to be laying here is going to be amazing. So I want to show you just a little bit of uh, some of the classrooms. We've got about nine different classrooms that we're going to be able to utilize uh, as we continue to grow and reach new families. I'll show you right in here real quick. Uh, this is one of the nursery spaces um, that uh, Westwood Baptist has opened to us so we can use. We've got some cribs and some toys and some different things that uh, babies will be able to um, utilize. And so, spoiler report, one of the members on our launch team is pregnant. Hey, so the church has got to grow. Uh, and so we're really excited about that, to be welcoming a baby and to be able to minister um, to their family as they continue to grow. I'll show you real quick one of the other nursery and toddler spaces. Again, just a miracle, standing in what God has uh, has done for us. I'll show you something that I know my Florida family is going to be real excited about if you ever come up to visit us here at Nashville, serve alongside of us right here. Boom. Uh, a little potluck space. I know y'all like to eat with an industrial-sized kitchen just beyond there so we can cook it up in the kitchen uh, and get you guys some good meals here as you fellowship with us here in Nashville. Um, so we're excited to be able to utilize that for different outreaches and opportunities to reach this community. And here's one of the spaces that currently my children are using and uh, more youth will continue to utilize. So got a nice little air hockey table. Oh, again, so much space for them to be able to run around and play and then engage with the Bible and fun games and all that great stuff here. So there's more hallways. Well, another blessing that we have is um, complete and total use of this room for storage space for the church. So we've got all our tables and supplies and uh, things like that are all in that room right there. Again, this is a miracle that God has provided. Never um, would I have thought uh, that this was going to be one of the ways that God opened the door for us in West Nashville, uh, but he did it, and I'm so glad he did. Isn't God awesome? He is the one who has opened these doors for us to be able to walk in, to lead people to the hope and life of Jesus Christ here in Nashville. I want to sincerely thank you. Thank you from the bottom of our hearts for all of your prayers. We believe that these doors were opened because of your prayers with us and for us as we continue to do the work of God here in Nashville. I wanna invite you to continue to partner with us in three ways. One, keep praying. This is just step one. We've just opened these doors to begin to build our team and continue to um, enlarge this space so that we can utilize it to the very best of our ability to train our team to take care of children and youth to provide a space of hospitality to host young families and new generations of people who are moving here to Nashville. And so we ask that you continue to pray for us, especially as we navigate this season with COVID-19. Uh, how do we gather people without really uh, supposed to being able to gather? But we know that we're going to be able to build deep and lasting relationships and 
help people find and follow Jesus. So continue to pray for us in this way, and we will continue to pray for you. Second, please continue to give. Your financial giving is what enables us to do ministry each and every week. I want to give you a praise report. Just this week, we were able to provide 500 water bottles to all the students at Charlotte Park Elementary. They needed reusable water bottles to provide their students. And because of your generosity, we were able to gift them that and serve them as a school in our neighborhood. And so we're just continuing to build partnerships like that every week. We invest in local and world missions, and we're continuing to see lives changed and transformed as a result of your giving. And lastly, you can go. God is calling us to be his workers in the harvest field. And I know that God is calling some of you to join us here in Nashville to plant a life-giving church that reaches people who are far from God, to see them come to new life in Christ, new relationships with the family of God, and then through those begin a new beginning in their God-designed purpose, and as they released and empowered to make a new sound in the world. And so we're so thrilled to, to witness what God is doing here in Nashville. We want to thank you for all your prayers and your giving, and we know that God is going to continue to send us out and to send some of you to join us and partner with him in his work here in Nashville. We love you and we bless you in Jesus' name.